today I wanted to talk about strategies for improving your results with your light therapy device. And one of the things that we highly recommend is what we call bilateral or contralateral illumination. And essentially what that is, is say your dog has an injury on its right front shoulder. We're going to ask you to also illuminate the left front shoulder. And the reason for that is uh, a little on the complex side because what we're doing is we're dealing with meridian systems which has electromagnetic energy running throughout the body. So if there is a blockage in any of the meridians and it is preventing circulation from coming through to that injured shoulder um, is going to help to balance that out. From the second perspective, we're also dealing with lymphatics. So anytime lymphatics are congested, it can inhibit and reduce circulation in an area. And so sometimes an animal may show up um, with like remote, reduced mobility or re reduced range of motion, and that could be because of lymphatics. So what the light also does is it encourages balance within that lymphatic system and gets that lymphatic system moving correctly. The third aspect of it is fascia release. So think of it, if your dog's shoulder is tight on one side, it and they're overcompensating on the other side because this, this shoulder might be tight, but the limping shows up here. What we want to do is we want to release that fascia. We want to normalize that fascia so they get free range of motion on both front shoulders. And it's been one of these things that we have seen over and over again with lots of different uh, conditions where somebody's like, hey, you know, I've been working on my dog's paw and I just can't seem to get the results that I'm looking for that I know the light should be doing. And so we'll just say, hey, you know what? Have you illuminated the opposite limb or the opposite side? And they're like, no, we haven't done that. And literally within 24 hours, there is a huge difference. So that's one of those things that is a great strategy to implement anytime you are working on any of your animals is where's the injury at? illuminate the opposite side as well and you're going to find that the body's going to get into balance quicker and it's also going to uh, overcome that injury a lot faster than it normally would. So happy red lighting, green lighting, and blue lighting your animals.